Holy snap, you have to see this. This okay. filling. It's insane. Good morning. How are you doing on this wonderful Sunday? Stefan and I are on our way to a Sunday brunch. Actually, it's the the gay pride hangover lunch at bar 5 and 33 in the art hotel so that sounds like a fun sunday after the brunch stefan and i are probably going to the movie theater again and i brought like my whole chocolate stash with me <laughs> well actually not everything of course i have more but um so the lint honey bar uh, all the leftovers from the um, from the lint chocolate tasting, yogurt, love yogurt, the gusa, <laughs> and, and the, the Varona blonde. This one's supposed to be incredibly good and a little bit caramelly, so I will update you on that one later. But you know, if they had this good chocolate at the at the cinema, I wouldn't need to bring it myself. But they don't have this good chocolate. <laughs> brunch here like a regular brunch you can do this on a sunday and it looks freaking delicious yeah, to see this. so we have muffins over here the whole restaurant is italian inspired <laughs> so lots of nutella yes. we want that and we have croissants on nutella over here some donuts over there waffles oh my gosh so over here we have the menu <laughs> All of the food, man. This is Lorena. Hi, so nice to meet you. So nice to meet you as well. <laughs> and um, you organize the PR for 5 and 33, right? Yeah. So this brunch, they can book it every Sunday? Every Sunday is the yeah. Sunday brunch. So yeah. you can come here, both with your friends or you know, family, whatever you like. Nice. And, uh, we're working also on some other concepts. So if you have, like, for example, your birthday or whatever. Oh, really? Right here. Oh, yeah. that's really cool. So, uh, yeah. Nice. Keep an eye out on the website. They have croissants with cream. Look at this. So Italian. This is the best. Mm. Okay. Mm. They made a virgin Bloody Mary especially for me. And let's try it. It's spicy, but I love that. And it's so freaking tasty. Mm. So Lorena has the classic X Benedict. Oh man, I miss this. This this was my favorite when I used to eat fish. It looks so freaking good. For me, they made a vegetarian version also without egg. Look at this, look at this. And Stefan has scrambled eggs with mushrooms. But wait, first in Nutella croissant. <laughs> so good. Holy snap, you have to see this. This filling. It's insane. And it's not too sweet, so it's it's really, really delicious. The third course of this brunch we can't eat anymore, but we have to because it's so good. So this is just yogurt and fruit and granola. This food was incredible. Stefan and I are both stuffed. Even he ate everything and he's such a picky eater. If you want to book it, you can book it on their website. I'm not sure, I'm, I asked what the price was, but we forgot to check it on the website. But I will link the website down below and uh, you can check it out. And it's like every Sunday you can do the Bloody, Mo uh, Bloody Mary Sunday brunch and they also have a virgin Bloody Mary. Ah, loved it. We're just walking towards the movie theater, but I had to show you this. So this is uh, the street towards Dam Square. Dam Square is over there, Central Station is just behind me. If you haven't been to Amsterdam before or you don't know this, these are the best fries in the Netherlands. And they are freaking good and it's mad value for money. You have to try this if you're here. I would recommend you to have dinner because it's such a humongous portion. Apparently I'm late to the party because 
there's a Primark coming to Amsterdam? I had no idea. Wow, you won't believe this and I have trouble believing it every time I see it, but yet it's true. No matter how stuffed we are, Stefan always has, has room for ice cream. And now this is the best value for money. So last time I said it was Hema, but this is 50 cents and you get like a big ice cream cone. So he's totally happy with this. <laughs> At the cinema and we are going to watch. I don't know if you can see that. Now you see me too. It's a cool movie. We love the first one. So going to watch the sequel. It was such a good movie. Oh my gosh. You don't, you shouldn't think about it too much. But the first movie was action packed. This one was also action packed. Lots of humor. Highly recommend. Now you see me too. We are both stuffed. But we still need to get some food. So the only thing I remotely I'm interested in is Grezo, something we have seen for quite a while and we wanted to get some food here and it's like a burgers and fries and stuff like that but like organic let's see and yeah you're very cute puppy here hey, yeah, puppy. I just gave me lots and lots of hugs where you going I can't focus on you when you're moving hello hello cutie Hello. 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 Oh, so cute. Hello, beautiful. Oh, so cute. Om nom 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 food. So, we have a veggie burger here. And I've heard from friend if they have brioche burgers, then it's really, really, really good. So, I'm gonna try this. And over here, oh gosh, that's so much good food. A hot dog. Mm -mm -mm, a veggie hot dog. And. Lots and lots and lots of fries. Yum! Let me try the burger. Ah. Mm. This is a really good veggie burger. Nom! And the hot dog, it's a little bit messy, but mm, I think it's gonna taste good too. Can I try it? I like the hamburger bun better. This bun is a little bit dry. But the veggie hot dog is good. Mm. If I would have to recommend you one of those two, I would say mm, get the veggie burger. It's better. And dessert, fish food, the Ben and Jerry's. Oh my gosh, this ice cream. It is chocolate ice cream with marshmallow and caramel swirls and chocolate fish. Mm -mm -mm. So freaking delicious. I'm gonna take off my makeup and brush my teeth and go to bed. Um, as you may know, today, or maybe you don't know, and I'm telling you, today uh, we're coming back from Germany, Baden-Württemberg, where the Flammkuchen was invented. So if you wanna see the pictures, you can check them out on Instagram and the vlog will be up next week on Friday because we left on Friday. And also you can follow me on Snapchat. I will be Snapchatting as well. Uh, for now, uh, I will see you again on Wednesday because when I'm at home and tomorrow and on Tuesday and Wednesday and Thursday, I will be at home. Uh, I don't vlog on Mondays and Tuesdays. So make sure to subscribe and not miss any Germany vlogs. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.